Hey everyone, this is Viper6. This is my current setup on the helmet for my GoPro and it's a bit of a monstrosity because uh, uh, there is actually no worry we can put a flat chin mount here so I ordered a part and we're gonna get rid of this friggin mess here and replace all that with this this should work out quite nicely and it fits right there it's contoured to it as close as possible there is still a bit of overlap at the top but uh, we'll make it work so I'm gonna clean this up and I also purchased this that goes here and that should uh, work out quite nicely we'll see how it goes be back in a sec so I cleaned everything with the alcohol prep they give you and this is the moment of truth. You really have to nail this properly or else you're screwed. That's as straight as it can be. Now this guy is going to go... Well, which way do I want to put it? Depends. Do I want the camera in the face or not? And we'll get this off of here. Now I have to get rid of that thing there. See how that goes. And the company I bought this from also gave me this for the mount. That will go there. Well, the bottom one's a little loose. That's an Allen key thing, so we'll have to fix that. I might replace that Allen key thing with another knob if it fits. We'll see. This might be too long. No, no, might be okay. Oh boy. And don't despair. Well, it's sitting crooked because I've got the Scala Rider over here. But if ever you got it mounted crooked, lo and behold, we have extra pads, so I just rip it off and realign it. Is this going to come off easy? Of course it won't. Good, tr good way to remove these is just heat it up with a blow dryer first, and then peel it off slowly, and then clean any glue residue, if there is any, with some rubbing alcohol. That's it. New setup for Viper 6. Ah, it looks fairly straight. I'm good. Let's hope it holds. I don't, I don't want to lose my camera here in Arizona on the highway doing 80 miles an hour, you know what I mean? Okay, now I'll clean the helmet because it looks disgusting. I need to tighten tighten that Allen key there on the side. See, like down here it's an Allen key, but I might just replace it with one of those. Because it looks like I have room and I've got a ton of these little stubby ones over here. I will do that. Later, people. I hope you like. This is so much more minimalistic. Now, if only I could uh, figure out uh, my audio here find a way to muffle it a little more so that it doesn't so that the gain doesn't max out and produce a lot of uh, crackling later <laughs>